is one of the most exciting AFL stars of the last 10 years. From kicking bags with the Kangaroos to becoming a Premiership player with the Demons. Everyone knows him for his long run-ups and long flowing hair. But now his curly locks are getting the chop. Please welcome Ben Brown. Benny Brown, good morning, mate. How are you? That's one of the cooler intros I've had already. <laughs> yeah. well, it's interesting you say that because um, Belle obviously worked very hard on that intro, and yeah. she, she's uh. you know she actually used to produce our show, so she's real into the facts and being like you know this is this is Ben Brown yada yada. Whereas I I'm sort of a, more of a melody guy, Ben. So I've also made an intro that didn't get up. Would you like to Would you I'd, like to hear it? Yeah, I'd love to. Okay, right. this was my idea. <laughs> Ready? What? Ready? Live in the studio. Which one do you like better? Uh, that one's definitely in the top 10 or 20. <laughs> yeah, okay. That's good. No, just good to see where you stand. Did you have time to do that? I, I, d- I ducked out <laughs> during, during one of the songs. Look, um, Ben, let's talk about you shaving off those gorgeous curls. Mm-hmm. Um, why are you doing this? Yeah, so um, I, I suppose the reason for it is my cousin Grace. Mm. Uh, she's 17 years old. Um, she's the life of a party, loves to dance. Uh, she's had a pretty tough run of it so far in mm. her short life. Um, at age six, she was diagnosed with uh, leukemia uh, for the first time. A um, few years down the track, was declared cured and in remission. Mm. Um, but then fast forward another few years after that, uh, diagnosed with leukemia for a second time. Uh, that second time through, we nearly lost her on a couple of occasions, mm. um, which you can only imagine what Grace went through, what her family went through. Uh, but... Uh, now she's in remission again, uh, mainly thanks to a new, brand new therapy called CAR T cell therapy. And Grace was actually the first child with wow. Down syndrome in Australia to receive that therapy. So Grace has been through a lot, mm-hmm. um, and that's why I'm lopping the locks off. So oh, that's that's awesome, mate. Obviously for a great cause, um, and uh, it's obviously about spreading awareness. Can can people? donate anywhere as well or is this for- yeah so this is all for challenge yep. um which is a, a children's cancer charity obviously but um they work not only with the children but also siblings parents those who are going through that journey with the child mm-hmm. and talking to my my uncle grace's father about uh challenge they, they were there on the ground with them right from the start and would provide opportunities for you know, siblings to have experiences. Also, Grace had experiences in the hospital. She was able to toss the coin at the MCG for Richmond Carlton, which was all provided by Challenge. And Challenge did that not only for, um, you know, Grace and her family, but for so Mm. many families who are going through the toughest time in their lives. So, Mm. that's why it's super important to me. Uh, So, we've set up a fundraising page at challenge.org.au so people can head there. There's a few little incentives for people as well. Oh, okay. Little bonuses if they want to. Um, they get maybe like a little lock here or there. Like <laughs> they can choose from the side. This is pretty iconic hair. I mean, a lot of people might want to get their hands on it, you know? What are you going to do with the hair? Are you uh, just going to chuck it away or that, are you going to maybe keep some? That's a really good question um, that we haven't entirely decided okay. on yet. Um, uh, should, I'd, I'd, I'd be interested in people's opinions. Yeah. yeah like if we frame it, it, put it up in the club there somewhere. <laughs> I don't know. If we can get like one lock, we'll buy one I would, lock. I think we can we'll all... donate. I'll course. chuck in 100 people. Yeah, yeah, hundred bucks. <laughs> yeah, same. Yeah, yeah okay. That's, I mean, that's three hundred. We'll donate if you can just maybe save, save a little lock in your pocket. Or also, something like if that. you want to see Ben shave his head, you can as well at Melbourne's Family Day at Yarra Park. It's Saturday, February twenty fifth. All money raised, of course, goes to the Challenge Foundation raising money for children with cancer. Have you ever shaved the head before when you were younger? Is the first time? No, no, first time. <gasps> uh, I had it shorter when I was younger. Yeah. Um, it's been it's been like this for probably 10, 11 years, so it's a long it's time. It's that scary thing as well of like, you're like, oh no, do I have a weird head? Like, you don't, you don't I, know what it looks like at the back? I've definitely thought about it. <laughs> well, you know what? It, have a giant birthmark that good. you don't know. Because yeah. obviously this isn't going to deter you. You're doing a great thing yeah. for your cousin for a great cause, but um, through the powers of Photoshop, we have actually worked out what you will look like okay. after the head is shaved. Uh, so this is Ben Brown saying it for the first time. How do you feel about that? <laughs> I, I hope I look slightly better than <laughs> No, that is literally what it will be. That's, that's, your, that's your head, Photoshop of that hair. Of course, we are going to pop that on the Ben Limbo Instagram so you can see it with your own eyes, but we didn't stop at bald. Yeah, we were thinking perhaps uh, one, once you get a little bit of regrowth, uh, maybe you could go the Dusted Martin. Um, 
Do you, like, do you like that one? Some feathering out the back? Uh, bald's probably better. <laughs> okay, bald's better. Um, what about this one? The Bailey Smith. <laughs> That's sexy. I don't mind that. Yeah. 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 And a bit of straightening will have yeah. to be done. Yeah. You'll be fine. Yeah. Lastly, just because we're on the computer and having fun, the Kim Jong-un. <laughs> um, the flat top at the top. It's a very iconic look. And for, someone, for someone that has iconic hair, would you consider this? I, I think I'll avoid okay, yeah, well, that one. Okay, mm. well, watch this space. Um, doing something for a great cause. Potentially going to look like <laughs> Bailey Smith in the next 12 to th- you know, 13, 14 months and definitely not Kim Jong-un. Make sure you support him. Ben Brown, thank you so much for coming in this morning and all the best with the head show. No worries. Thanks for having me, guys.